a soft spoken but a decisive leader who ensured his troops brought their best foot forward in serving and protecting the masses across the Great Omsati region. Commissioner Shikongo's life in uniform spans across four decades, having been a plain combatant and upon his return from exile, worked in the Namibia Defense Force as a soldier before getting a job in the police force. For the past week, he spent most of his hours packing up and ensuring he clears his table of any pending matters. It wasn't an easy task, as you know, Omsaki. One, uh, politically, the, it was uh, a, a very hotbed. Uh, you had a lot of uh, commotions. You have to make sure you talk to everybody. You make them understand to be politically matured, uh, to make sure everybody operates freely within that uh, democratic environment, try to convince uh, the people uh, without uh, causing harm to anyone, without disturbing any other one. Shikongo was both loved and loathed for his stance on implementing COVID-19 regulations, where he dispersed crowds at weddings. Shikongo says he retires on a positive note, with only three unsolved cases in the region and hopes that the incoming commander will make a breakthrough. It's the biggest regret, yes. Probably we did not do enough, but uh, I know uh, we have tried our best and uh, the, 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 the incoming commander with this trusted leadership, I believe they, they will still try to talk to us. And remember, I'm also going in there as a member of public. Should I pick anything, I'll be still having police in me, a police officer out of uniform. He will be replaced by Commerce Regional Commander Commissioner Ismail Basson, who will take up office on the 9th of September. Ndapandashuya, NBC News. Oh, tapi.